So I just wanted to add on to uh, CNN coming out with the narrative right away of how many weapons he was, I don't know how they knew or if they were there or whatever, but um, uh, didn't they change his uh, age or whatever? But uh, yeah, it looks like the ATF can't add either. Uh, if she's reading a script, um, it says uh, 6 and 7 is 13. So she comes out and says 13 right away, and then she changes the number to 14 twice. So if she's reading a script, uh, it says 13 first, and then it says 14, and it repeats that twice in the script. Covered 13 weapons. Um, out of those 13 weapons, uh, we currently have in custody six were recovered at the school, seven were recovered at the shooter's residence. All 14 have been traced to a federal firearms dealer. They are all at different stages currently in the tracing process. Eight of the 14 have been traced to first, uh, uh, first uh, trace purchasers. Um, seven have been purchased by, sh by the shooter or a family member, all within the last three years. In addition to the weapons recovered, we also were able to recover a flank jacket uh, was recovered lying next to the rifle at the school. Uh, the jacket had steel plates along with five magazines. Uh, an additional amount of ammunition was also recovered at the apartment. <laughs>